All right, it's time to get the dinner going in the crock pot. Uh, just have to grab something from my cupboard. We're going to do pork tenderloin. And I'm actually going to put some green peppers in there. My sister gave me some from her garden yesterday. A little baby one hasn't grown up yet. Um, I have a couple of them. I think I'll just do one. We'll see if one is enough. And she gave me um, some huge into <laughs> grape tomatoes, which are really good, really juicy. And and um, another another tomato. I think a couple of tomatoes that we had this morning with Berkey. So uh, yeah, let's get to making a dinner. I'm just gonna set it in the crock pot and uh, let the crock pot do the cooking. All right, so we are set up in the crock pot with the tenderloin. It's, I am. It actually came out of the package in two pieces. I thought it was one piece. Um, we're going to do a mixture with the Diana garlic, honey garlic sauce, um, that Worcestershire sauce, what I have left of ketchup, and I was just at No Frills this morning because I ate laundry detergent, um, but I forgot the ketchup and a little bit of brown sugar, and then I will uh, dice that up. Oh, and a packet of um, onion soup mix, and just toss that in there. Here's what's left of one of the tomatoes. I think that was all because these ones, I have a couple that were free. They were set out by the Free Little Library. I saw a post on Facebook and I got that one for free and it was just from somebody's garden but they had too much and I think that's this one. It was a little, a little yellow. It turned a little bit more red um, and I think this one, maybe these ones, yeah these ones were from my sister and this one and then one other one yeah really really good like look at the size of that <laughs> that's a tomato on steroids really good though and I mean juicy it like squirts all over okay I'm gonna cut this I'll cut this up over here because that's where the clone board is Get this going. That's about right. That's good enough. Yeah, chips. <laughs> like, what's that in the frame? <laughs> oh, chips. What's your size? Get that out. And just like a tablespoon or two of sugar. There goes the ketchup. Welcome to my kitchen. Chaos. Chaos cooking <laughs> real life cooking I don't edit that kind of stuff out their channels mate but not me I keep it real go mm, yep all right that's good Okay, and just pour that all over. That was a pretty good right amount. Look at that, perfect. Okay. Pepper. Oh, and the pepper too. Okay, I'm just gonna sprinkle this on top. Oh, that smells so good. Mm. Yep. That's it. Okay, then I'm gonna cut up the pepper and uh, wash my hands first, of course. And uh, yeah, be right back. 
All right, green pepper ready to go. Just place in the same bowl. Why? <laughs> Get another bowl and just, yeah, dump that in. Looks good. Smells good. And that's what's for dinner tonight. I'll probably do mashed potatoes and corn on the cob, of course, which I am really, really looking forward to. Yes, okay, so, um, on high, it's probably only take a couple hours, so I'm gonna do around two, two and a half. Yeah, okay, all right. Now we uh, put your feet up. The kitchen smells fabulous, woo! facial <laughs> and uh, yeah we are looking pretty good mm -hmm. yeah she is almost done all right so since that is almost done the potatoes are going on the stove but they're in the pot <laughs> i need to do the corn luckily corn doesn't take too too long so let's um get the corn ready in the meantime um i have to grab the big bag on the floor okay and now nuggets are ready to go in the, <laughs> in the oven um this big bag of beautiful corn from subbies i will do six i think because i will probably have at least place two. Oh, there goes seven like that's so rude interrupting me but you know <laughs> y'all probably do six i'll uh, figure out a uh, a different way to do them because the potatoes are in that pot, um, but I, I think I know what, what I'm going to do. All right, so let's get husking. Let's see. One, two, buckle my shoe. <laughs> yeah. Three, four, and then yeah, like some of them are huge. There's one in here. Like, yeah, it's this one. Okay, this one. Look at the size of this guy. Like, you can tell there's like one on the side here. Um, yeah, so let's open this one up and see, cause it's like, yeah, this is like two for one. Well, you have one here, but I don't, don't know how much, like maybe like right there. There's nothing here, but like right there. So yeah, let's open that one. Uh, see, yeah, okay, and one more yeah I was on TikTok I was upstairs relaxing with Lois and uh, I was on TikTok and somehow I found myself on the cleaning side of TikTok but not just like any cleaning um, cleaning slash decluttering there's somebody on there who's doing um, a 30-day cluttering um, and I'm like a lot of it like when you see like a really messy really messy some of these houses are really messy and it's because of people's you know mental health and that has a huge factor in in that how dirty messy their house is um i think i, I landed on three or four different you know decluttering slash like really dirty like and i mean dirty like kind of like what you see on the hoarding um episodes that were on tv um and there was there is one where her mom she bought back the she bought the back the house um or she she bought it so that it wouldn't be taken away because i think her no not her mom her grandma her grandma and she was a hoarder and the stuff in the rooms it's just it's like wow you know piled up and it's just like watching an episode of of hoarders and but it's like a lot of it has to do with mental health and yeah, um, and I just and I just watched one. And I was like, oh my gosh, the kitchen was so dirty. And um, makes my kitchen look pretty nice. I do want to do a, a nice deep clean in my kitchen. Haven't done it yet, but um, there's just you know I have to wait till the burnout is done. And um, because I know there'll be stuff to drop off at Valley Village. Cause I want to go through the cupboards and stuff that I haven't used. I mean, oh, I got ketchup on the cupboard there. <laughs> and, um, I I'm gonna have to like get like some sponges and get some some stuff and just like do a really good deep clean but yeah I just somehow found myself on the cleaning side of TikTok and some of the houses are just like wow oh, wow yeah like you know it's to the point where it's like how, how do you live like that like it's just that gross right but 
a lot of it has to do with house, declining house. Yep. Let's see if it's just a husk. Oh, just a husk. Okay, I was curious. It's like, is there like a little mini one in here? Oh, 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 there is. Look at that. <laughs> Just a little baby. Look at that. Are you, are you gonna cook that one? Yeah, I'll cook it for Lois. Who likes corn? She likes this part. I don't know why. She's a silly, silly girl. Yeah, she is. Yeah, she is. Alright, she's right here. And do you like corn? Yes, yes, you do. Is that for you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, that's pork. I'm not going to cook that, though. Yeah, it's like really, it feels really rubbery. Can I be one? Yeah, sure. There you go. Take a pick. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's see what's in this one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's what I might be able to cook. This one doesn't feel as rubbery. <laughs> it's just a little baby. He didn't grow up yet. No. That's what this one's like. I also, the trivia pages on TikTok seem to be finding me. And like, there's one I follow, and they have like your plastic eggs, you know, that you find at Easter, and like, there's like, I don't know, usually like, I think maybe like eight or nine, okay, they're all in each other, right? So, bigger to smallest, right? And they ask questions, they ask like two people trivia questions. And that one's fun to watch, and this new one came across my feed page. And, yeah. Oh, okay. Pause. Okay, so this new trivia TikTok page, they have it set up where there's poker chips. So many poker chips on each side of the people that are answering the questions. And the winner gets a shot of whatever liquor they have, okay? And the first one that I watched, and it was so funny, these two girls, like, it, it does, it, it makes you laugh, and they were asked, what is Canada's nat national um, animal? And they were saying, like, oh, the goose, no, no, and then, a beaver. Yeah, yeah, beaver, it's beaver, but uh, I took a few guesses, the one girl said cheetah, and then koala, and then the guy was like, it starts with a B, and they're like, oh, beaver, <laughs> oh my gosh, so, are you, are you even Canadian? No, I, no, they're not, I don't think they were Canadian, no, um, and then like, another question was, like, they were funny, they were funny, another question was, what is the currency? in Japan and she's like yen and they're like yeah so she actually knew that one and she goes I'm so full of knowledge and I'm like if you were full of knowledge you wouldn't be throwing out all these guesses you would like guess all of them right away you know but because she got that one right away um you know she's full of knowledge and then another question was um when is spring when do we spring um back what month and and they were like april um may and then one girl got it in march and the white girl goes oh we're gonna spring spring forward lead back <laughs> that's just that's so funny it's just funny watching that and just the the answers that people give and like they were funny like and they were so funny because they were like cheering each other on they were like supporting each other yeah i think they were friends uh, but it was just so funny. You get a good laugh, and sometimes, you know, we need a good laugh. Just forget forget your problems. And laugh at people's trivia answers. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just so funny. Thank you. You're doing good. 
There goes two. Okay. Well, you're higher. Okay, and we'll get the corn going. Oh, we got 20 minutes on dinner. Oh, thank you. Tickle, tickle. It's a brush. Oh, it's a brush. <laughs> nope, she, she's not here anymore. <laughs> the guy's slowest and I want to help. She will bite. She'll bite the ends of the corn. And I, I don't know what, what's so fascinating about it, but yeah. There you go, this corn does look good. Nina said that was good, so we will see. This is the worst part, trying to get the little hairs off as much as you can. And if we don't eat all of it, we'll like put it in the fridge and eat it tomorrow for lunch. Sometimes there's like a couple left over. It depends. If it's really, really good, yeah, we'll have probably two each and just enjoy every single bite. Oh. Yeah, I make a Dollarama list because I think I'm gonna get Mr. Clean sponges for when I do my counters, and then I can like clean a kitchen, even if we're, you know, still doing the Reno. I'll, I'll get it done. Little baby, I'm just a baby. <laughs> Hi, little baby. Hi, little baby. Hi, little baby. Yeah, it is lowest size. I'm going to cook this corn. I'm going to check with the potatoes as they're done. Oh, more. thank you. You're hired. Oh, one more. You are hired, sir. There we go. Oh, shit, one's pretty good. Okay, and uh, I'll be right back. All right, this is what I'm doing with the corn. Um, using my deep pan here which is great for fried rice and um corn apparently so yeah there we go that works i'm gonna put on the stove and should be done we have 16 more minutes left on the crock pot all right i have a yummy yummy plate look at that golden delicious corn pork mashed potatoes so uh i have a facial <laughs> let's dig in and test out this corn so cooking it in that pot worked out great. Let's take a little bite. Mmm. That is good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's good. Oh. Really good. I already did try a piece when the hubby cut it up the pork so I know that's good. Bon appetit. Mm -hmm. All those flavors, the green pepper, the onion soup mix, the barbecue sauce, mm -hmm. two thumbs up. I'm going to eat this and enjoy it and probably grab another corn because it's that good. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time video, but I figured I would get an extra video out because I know we're not doing much this week. So I figured you guys can hang out with me in the kitchen and help me cook dinner. <laughs> Keep me company. So I'll see you next time video. Take care, be blessed, and um, talk to you for now. Bye.